Nothing beats the heat like a cool sandwich style salad. But if you want to cut down on your meat intake and use less plastic and eat a little greener, store-bought chicken salads just don't cut it. So instead, I created this absolutely delicious vegan chickpea salad that is great on sandwiches or in a salad. It's so great, I simply call it chickpea nom nom, and it's perfect for a hot summer's day, lunch, or dinner. So let's get ready to devour our vegan, plastic-free, local ingredient chickpea salad. Nom nom. At first glance, there are quite a few ingredients, but this is a really simple and easy recipe. You can pre-prepare some of the ingredients if necessary, such as the chickpeas. Now you can use a canned chickpea if you like, or prepare from dry. Just soak three quarter cups of dry chickpeas in three cups of water overnight and cook on low for three to four hours the next morning. For your root veggie, today I'm going to be using a previously roasted beet. You can also use sweet potatoes, steaming them rather than roasting, or carrots work really well too, and when roasted they add a great crunch. For the creamy dressing, we are going to need one half cup of non-dairy yogurt and veganaise. We're going to use either lemon or lime juice, both will work great. Some thyme, red curry paste, and some paprika, curry, and turmeric. To add some crunch, we're going to need two stalks of celery or radishes. And for the sweetness factor, we're going to add about a half a cup of raisins. And finally, for some more crunch, we're going to add some cashews or other nuts of your choice. First, let's make our curry sauce. We're going to add one half cup yogurt and one half cup veganaise in a large, and I mean large, bowl. Add one to two tablespoons of lemon or lime juice and one tablespoon of red curry paste. Add two teaspoons of thyme and the other spices, one teaspoon curry, one teaspoon turmeric, and one teaspoon of paprika. Stir very well together and mix all the ingredients and flavors. So you can add some salt if you need, to need it or some more spices if desired. We're going to set that sauce aside while we're prepping the rest of the salad. Let's go ahead and toast our cashews and you can roast these in the oven if you're roasting your carrots or you can saute them over medium heat on the stove top. Just stir them until they start browning and then set them aside. We're going to chop our crunchies and set those aside. And if you're making sweet potatoes or carrots, you'll have them already chopped, but then we're going to actually today we're going to dice our beet. And now we're ready to combine all of our ingredients together. We'll add the beets to the sauce bowl and then the crunchy veggies. Add your one half cup raisins and the two cups cooked chickpeas. We'll stir them well and then add our toasted cashews and mix just a little bit more. Now for us, we love our chickpea salad on lettuce, but this is delicious as a wrap or a sandwich. And now it's time to nom nom and see how this dish got its name. 